So I'm using, yes, me, I'm using this one right now. And uh, I messed up a bit with the tiger, the leopard. It's not a tiger, it's a leopard. And I'm actually going to add another element, which is nucleus. I don't know, I'm not pronouncing it very well. It's an underwater ancient um, organism. Crustaceous. So, yeah. My feel of expertise is not um, per se uh, zoology, but I do enjoy learning a few things about them. So, as soon as I create a design to this here, I want to be able to add. I really like this one so far. And it curves down. What I like about these two things is the, the color and the stripes. I thought that uh, a very striking semblance to a tiger. This one has spots. This is a leopard. But the tiger itself is very similar. Um, but for right now, I'm going to... I'm using this here because uh, I should use a tiger. <laughs> but um, I don't know. That was my motivation for today. I want to see if I could uh, I find nature and all the living uh, pre his existing creatures that survived so many different um, historical man-made uh, disasters are still alive. I mean, it impresses me completely to know that they're uh, existing. Uh, you probably can't even see very well from that. Let me see if I can add special lighting. I hope you can see. Would you turn the light up? I will, I guess, in a uh, few minutes. I'm trying to my son here, he's wonderful. Um, he's been helping me a lot with my creative um, pursuits since he existed. So, um, I'm actually very lucky to have a son like my son. He very thoughtful, very considerate, and um, we used to paint live together <laughs> at some point in our uh, you know, journey. And I love that uh, he can be him. I love that he can be his own self. And uh, I think as a parent, you want to see the best of all those things, too. Um, to discover the unknown, I utilize a lot of the fish or because I don't see this on a normally normal basis. The texture, the how how can something like this in the deep water can exist? To 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 uh, see the separation, it's not a straight line. It's just gradual differences. So I'm trying to do mimic that by pixelating somehow and then gradually pixelate further on this side versus the other side by slightly moving away and then get into the more of the circular texturized surface the same thing this way we go here so Mother Nature. It's impressive. I don't know how an animal can see through us through this, 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 this tiny tiny thing, but they do. Uh, it's 
tell on my design if I do it quick enough, it'll look like an animation. Yeah, this is the tooth. So. See if I have enough space for the the shell itself. So the the, the design of the wish I could uh, my hair. Um, I can't say I'm shedding, but uh. If I could also do some interesting uh, tentacles. Let's see if I could design. Oh yeah. yeah. It's a little hard to do two hands at the same time. But I'll manage for now until I uh, get a routine. So it stems from the front. And then it goes to the back. That's what happens when you look at the camera and not look at what you're doing. <laughs> oh no. Uh, I, I really need a large. Tomorrow I'm going to go to Blake's on you know, 125th Street and get some more. Um, get some more um, uh, paper. Bigger one maybe. And, uh, and then here you can see that it's a. Uh, Uh, how do you call it? Dab. A little dab. Inside here is a lot of. Uh, I want to do some comic books with my little alien things. I don't know. Look, I'm morphosizing all of these different things. Alright, so now what I'm going to do is an octopus um, tentacles. It seems fitting, right? So, I might stand it from here. And they have these little suckers. Maybe I could twist. So I could twist in here. You can actually see all the actual design. Slowly I incorporate. I want to say thank you to my son for setting this table up for me. Mm -hmm. It's so nice that, um, again, I can, I really am highly ap appreciative of, of this presence. It really is thoughtful. Um, he actually helped me set it up in his private room. And I know that as a teenager, you know, one wants to have their privacy. And, and knowing these special time is... Just grateful. I don't want to impose or anything like that. I mean, it's really nice that he was able to say, "Hey, mom, I'm gonna use my um, is it she? Thank you, baby, too."
with the longer lines that take my time. It may not be symmetrical much. Now for the reverse, the bottom part up gives you the extra depth. See? By this time, you put pressure on it. Alright, this is a leopard something, something, something. I wish I had blue. Damn it. So, yes, I'm going to um, Blix tomorrow to get to get some colors. I'm using this is this for some of them. Yeah, not really. Some people get really into the smell of this. Hi, I'm using blue because it's an undertone to it. I want it purple too, but at least the bottom part can be semi-dynamic. But underwater creatures have these dynamic colors that may or may not look. I guess you belong together. Hold on. See, I need some supply. <laughs> so cool. Bro. All right, here we go. I just did a. Maybe have some vibrant purples or something. Well, yeah, this is one that I did today. Hopefully, I'll post it up. So I'm off. My thing don't really work today. All right. Enjoy the rest of your quarantine. <laughs>